Hello and welcome. I'm Zinder. Here we are playing Feed the Beast. Uh, so there was a few changes that got a bit missed because I had a slight issue with some audio stuff. Everything should be sorted out now, but uh, yeah, basically I've got uh, dusts coming out of here. This is an electric furnace with uh, the uh, this the transformer upgrades. They are so easy to make as you can see because that's just that so I have one of these in each of these uh, I know they can take medium voltage for sure and the two of these together drew were drawing more power than uh, one of these could output in a packet so I have two MFE set up next to each other down here and uh, they're going into the electric furnace with an overclocker upgrade of eight and there's a macerator with an overclocker upgrade of eight. The two of these will process materials from the quarry faster than both of these setups put together, which this one got slight changed and I'll get into that in a second. Now, this up here, I'm feeding in cobble. It's making gravel and sand. The gravel I've been just taking out manually. Sand is going in here, getting smelted in the glass, then gets pulled into the system where it doesn't sit in here for very long because it comes in and I smelted all of that aluminum into the aluminum which is feeding into here along with glass and they are making glass viewers those are being made because I did work on the island crystals I have four portals set up here and I finished the floor which is good, and I'm sure you can see why I'm making glass viewers now. So, anyhow, this one goes to the overworld, and it's marked by stone bricks. This one goes to the nether, and it's marked by basalt, uh, the smelted basalt. This is the end, as marked by end stone. And if you look very closely, you can see the text for them through objects. See? This is the uh, Twilight Forest. I marked it with Live Root. I gained that through a very, very interesting method. Which is to say, I grabbed them, put them above something, and let go. And it turns into a block. When normally it would turn into sticks. But, uh, I've got some of the brick stuff from, like, similar stuff like these, or actually all these. But I didn't use them for the floor because I needed the top side to look like that. But, uh, yeah. That's pretty much that. I'm, I'm thinking about doming this off. Not sure on that one, though. Hmm, more eggs. But, uh, I should probably put this back where it needs to be, which is in the floor. There we go. I, uh... I haven't really been doing much else though. Been playing a lot of APB, which is. And I actually ended up with a normal sleep schedule, which means that uh, that is where I made some fiber cable. Glass fiber cable. But uh, what that means is that because I'd been on a regular sleep schedule as well, I was playing with people and then it's really hard to record. I've been over this once before. The moment I go to get off TeamSpeak or something, they bother me. If I say I'm going to go record something, they're like, no, come play. And it's very hard to work with. You know, those type of people. But uh, I'm think I still kind of want to make a use of this router for something, but I'm not sure how I could do that. I could technically set up a router setup where I can, like, pull out things but that seems like a lot of work. I could technically use barrels, export the ores into barrels, and then just use routers to send them between a, a large number of connected machines, which that may or may not work as intended. Probably not. I'm not sure. You know, I'm actually kind of interested now how routers work with these things. I don't think I have an ejector. Do oh, I do have an ejector. Uh, sure, why not grab all of them? Do I need anything else? Ra- Right? Router. This is not giving me the list of things. 
Machine filter, item filter. Because these things can easily output on their own. But inputting could be slightly more difficult. Who knows? But uh, what does this take? Uh, logic matrix. Which means that I need to find dungeons, I believe. I'm not sure if you can find those in the uh, mine shafts. I'm not sure if there's an easy way to actually... Let's put these back. I'm not sure if there's an easy way to actively... Give me that. Locate spawners in the world. Oh. So, I'm going to have to actually kind of look into that. Okay, now that my inventory is clear, I'm going to charge my... Oh, that's the chest. Charge my legs. And the chest. Okay. So I have a ton of bread. This thing has just kind of been running... What is your problem? Hmm. I'm going to actually need to bring dirt over, I think. That's no fun. How'd that happen? Do I even have any dirt? Yes, I do. Yes, that, that should be enough. Dirt, 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 dirt. The only thing I can guess is like an enderman or something came in here and started trampling my crops. Other than that, I have no idea. Oh well. That'll sort itself out. Uh, anyhow. So yeah, I've got quite a bit of bread. And I'm going to be honest, I kind of want to make the Gravisuit stuff. Because uh, one of the big reasons why I didn't make the Gravisuit before is because there was, there was only the solar helmet. However... And if you... These right here, the, the ultimate solar helmets, you can't make them. All they really are is a 512k solar helmet, though. Or not 512k, but 512 EU per tick solar helmet. And uh, there's one of those in one of the mods. So you could put that on. Yeah, it's not going to, you know, match. But it's a solar helmet that generates what you need for the gravity chest plate, which won't do me a whole lot of good working inside this mountain, but if I'm on, like, running around or something, uh, it's a portable energy source, so I'll never have to worry about power. But the gravity stuff is expensive. Uh, if, like, if we just look at the gravitation engine, iridium plate. As for the coolant cells... What? Coolant. How do you get coolant? Nobody knows. Oh. What? What did I break? Ah, uh, okay. I see. So, I could work on these. Um, the only problem is, is, first of all, I would need a fabricator line to create all the necessary things. I sort of had one before. I say sort of, because I only sort of had them. What do I need? Solar. I need solar panels, which requires generators. I'm sure you can see how this could end up being a problem. And I don't know why it doesn't want to give me the RE batter battery uh, mechanic. Mechanic! Mechanic. I am good with my English today. Now, if I'm right, it should be tin, tin, redstone, redstone, copper cable. So, if I were to put you in there, put you in there. One, two, one, two, three, four. So that would make me 16 of these. If I made everything else I need, which I have a ton of iron. 
but it needs to be refined iron. Which I have a good bit of that too. Uh, let's see, six, 64 of them. Oh, that's a machine block. Oops. I need regular iron as well. Eight of them. Why? Because I can. Okay, so now if I start throwing these in here, it'll make those. Oh. Okay, yeah, it did eat it. Good. Clear you. Put you in those. One, two, three. Two, three. And I needed the batteries, which are over here. Woohoo! Generators! This is why fabricators are amazing. Now, what was the rest of what I needed? I needed electronic circuits. Oh. I need... I have another fabricator. How did that happen? So if I put that there... I'm not too concerned about obliterating my rubber supply, to be honest. I just don't know if it can pull from a barrel, so this is actually a pretty good test. Okay, so... One, two, three. No. It cannot pull from a barrel. Disappointing. Okay. There we go. Now, I need... I'm going to need redstone. Uh, refined iron, which I have. Actually, I need... Like that. Yeah. Except for I'll probably want to make twice as much. Right, you don't need to be there. This might be a bit boring. And it's going to be mostly done in a crafting window. And I apologize. Do I have... I guess technically I'd need 12 stacks of cable, wouldn't I? We'll put 6 in there. Okay, that made 64 of them. I need... Basically 3 more stacks. I don't know why, but that sounds like it's a lot of rubber. Oh. Oh. That's six more stacks. No. No. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, one. Oh. Alrighty then. Uh, that made that. Generator. Electronic circuit. I need, what is it, glass panes? I don't know, just regular glass. Shit. Here's a terrible idea. Well, if I'm right, this shouldn't be doing anything currently, for the most part. With any luck, I... Well, other than draining my entire power source in like two seconds. Let's go resolve that, hopefully. With any luck, I can get three stacks of glass and outdo this machine which I am beating this machine fairly quickly pretty good uh, I don't think I have another export bus do I? no 
I mean, I could technically make one. I could technically bring that one down to just straight make glass out of sand. Got enough sand for a while, so... Eh. I'll let that build up. What was... I need to pulverize coal. Three times. Do I... I have another pulverizer, don't I? Yes. Yes, I do. Uh, we'll put it right there. And right there. Coal dust? Very good. I guess I can't really do much right now. I'm waiting on glass, which is going to be done fairly quick. And I'm also waiting on the coal to be pulverized, which will be done reasonably quick. I still have plenty of sticky resin in here. And I could put it in the extractor, but uh, I'm not going to bother with that at the moment. I'm going to look at low voltage solar panels, so I need these. I'm going to need eight of them. Yeah. Okay. So, that means... Oh, heck with it. I need 30... No. I need 16 cable. And I need wood. Right. I need 32 wood. What was in the middle? I wasn't paying attention. Copper. Okay, so. 24 copper. I need copper cable and wood, which it should accept the red wood. No problem. So I'm making eight of them, and I only need to put it in four corners, so that should do it. And there we go. Can't make these yet. I'm gonna forget the order. Okay, B. Not you. Are you done? Yes, you are. Are you done? Yes. Which means the other one's also done. Yes. Which probably also means that. I should probably check the glass before I stop the exporting, shouldn't I? One, two, three. Okay. How much power did I drain? Oh, God. Now, oh, one of them is still full. So we're good there. This may be slightly boring. I apologize. Or, it might be interesting watching me make things with fabricators. Who knows? Okay, click. 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 Done. Now... I guess we don't need those in there. Do, 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 do. Boom. And now I can make a medium voltage out of that, which is a number. I think it's actually 128 EUs per tick. But, uh, so we need 16 refined iron. I believe I still have some of the gold cable in here. Yes, I do. I need four of that. Medium voltage transformer. And you're probably wondering why I made two of them. It's because I believe there's exactly eight down here. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Hello? Do I have two? So. I had to dig underneath, and I crashed my game, so that was fun. 
Uh, but here we are, eight of them. Let me out. Fly over here. Throw these in here. Boom. Yes, it's going to take a very long time to get to a high voltage solar array. And I could probably resolve that really quick uh, with export buffers and import buffers and this, that, and whatnot. But, for now, this will do for our current system, theoretically. And there we go. Now, I suppose we'll come down here and look how the power situation is. Yes, look at it gain the power. It's currently splitting it between the two of them. When this one gets full, it will uh, definitely fill up quicker. But uh, I'll probably make a lot more of those off camera. Because once I get, if I, I probably have enough materials, give or take, to make all of them. Just all of them. That's all I have is a number. So, that shouldn't be a huge deal. Unfortunately, one high voltage solar panel is going to take eight times what I had just spent in materials. But, I'll build that, try and make, I think, nine of them. I'll put eight down there, then I'll have to do some serious upgrading and stuff. Oh. The thing is, we'll have to, in order to actually hold the power easily, we'll have to make uh, some MFSUs. Which also means I'll definitely need medium voltage transformers and this, that, and whatnot. So, uh, probably what I'll do with those, those? With those, though, is I'll put uh, the medium voltage transformer along the line. So it'll go into this MFE, which can only output at 128, because it's just this guy, which is why I should probably hook those into the actual line now. Crap. Uh, what I'm talking about is I should probably take these and hook that there and there. Because now that means that that one's going to slowly get charged. There's always going to be power for these machines. And it also means that these guys down here will be able to get the full force of what they're able to get. So, right now it's splitting it both ways. But if I, if I fill up that MFE over there, these will get all the power they can get. Which will eventually be a lot higher. But, yeah, I think this is going to be good for now. Uh, you know what, let's just make an MFSU right now. Oh, They are not cheap. They're not expensive, but they're not cheap. Each one of them takes six diamonds. Stuff out of here. Compressor. Next metal ingot. I don't... Do I have bronze? Do I have an easy way to make bronze? Uh... It's bronze blend. Eh, yeah, I can make it in the induction smelter that is working overtime right now. So, yeah, I don't. I have a little bit of bronze. How much bronze did I need? Each one of those makes two. I need two plates. Oh, I only need three bronze. And the top one, you know, I really should pay attention to these things. And this is eight. And an MFE, which MFEs are easy enough. I'm pretty sure I've showed this before. Tin and refined iron. Okay. So, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Crafting. If... Uh, thankfully, the Direwolf 20 pack does not have Greg Tech, because if it had Greg Tech, that would be a pain in the ass. That is an extractor. Do, 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 do. I'll have to use this compressor again. It was kind of a pain. 
So I need 16 coal. I'll put uh, 8 here and 8 here. I guess I'm not calling this good just yet. Ooh, carpenter. Ooh, thermionic fabricator. What am I doing? Running around wasting time. Okay. So, take these, arrange them like so. Raw carbon fiber, arrange them like so. Carbon fiber mesh. Put them in here. Press them. Go make a machine block while I wait. Do 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 do. Uh, compressor. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. So, vent circuit, glowstone, redstone, lapis, and electronic circuits. So I need a lot of electronic circuits. Twelve, thirteen. Okay, so hell with this. Why do I have this? Oh. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. Sure. Why not? Whatever. That's my solution at the moment. Terrible solution, I know. What was I doing? I need... Six of those. Six times eight is forty-eight. Then I also need... Four... Two... Two. Don't I need more lapis as well? Six. Times six. It's thirty-six. And let's just use the fabricator because it's here. Hooray! Lapis. Hooray! Um... Most inconvenient way to make that. Hooray! Oh. I'm missing an item. Can you tell what it is? It's an MFE. Oh, didn't mean to do that. One, two, three, four. Broom, 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 broom. Oh, convenient. Uh, this also means I need the four last gold cable. I need another machine block. Distracting myself, making this take longer than it should because I'm trying to do everything from memory and this, that, and whatnot. It's actually kind of sad that I know these things from memory. Ta da! MFSU. So, I can actually put this in the line right now as it stands. No, I can't. Uh, I need... I need... to make more things! Because us. Because us. Yes, because us. Oh, 
Where am I going? I need to make another machine block. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh no, those didn't need to be in there. I wanted those in the other thing. I want you in there. I am being retarded, but it'll be okay. Now, so, I'll go over here. I will break this. No, I'm actually going to put it here. That is too high. Random piece of copper. That'll go there. That'll output on all sides just fine. Put this in here. And I want the side to be the output. It is currently nighttime. God, I hope nothing explodes. You know, this was probably a good length before I decided, let's make an MFSU, because I'm going to need one eventually. Okay, so. Nothing appears to have exploded yet. It's always a good sign. Let's go over here and see the, how things are doing. This hasn't exploded. And that and the two over here were my biggest concerns for things that would explode. Which they haven't. And this is actually feeling quite well, so yeah. I guess what I'm going to do is, because barrels don't work... I'm going to, well, I can actually use barrels if I use the router and the ejector upgrade, which is actually a genius idea. And then, uh, yeah, basically. So I can set up the barrels, throw whatever I need in them, set them up in a router network. It'll pull as it needs to, I hope. Screw that. I'll just, I'll just make everything myself manually off screen. And I'll have it ready for next time. Just make an ass load of high voltage solar panels because, and then set up a matter fabricator or mass fabricator. Matter fabricator is the Greg Tech one. But I'll make this next time. I think this is actually cheaper than an MFSU. What the fuck? But anyhow, I'm going to call this good. So I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.